Okay, Mass Effect 3 walkthrough on Insanity. Man, that's probably the first time in this entire guide I've said that. But this is on Insanity. I, Yeah, it's on Insanity. And this is probably the worst checkpoint ever because I had to do this section twice because I died. I think it saves right before the boss, which I always find kind of cheap. Like, when it saves during sections of bosses. Didn't do it this time, but... Mass Effect has the tendency to do this with boss fights. Which there weren't a lot of in Mass Effect 3, I have to say. I was expecting more. But I digress. Uh, yeah, take those guys out. This is really why I like to focus on the passive upgrades to these guys, not their active abilities. Where they do more damage with assault rifles, give upgrades to their squad mates, all that stuff. Um, that stuff's really useful because when you're not commanding them, which is most of the time, unless you're like... I don't know, like, someone who would command them all the time, then they're going to actually be doing something and also not dying because they'll have more health. Also, these Cerberus Troopers are all going to be focusing on the pod, which, if you're halfway uh, awake when you're doing this mission, shouldn't really get that low. I mean, it's at, what, 75%? So just, yeah, just clean these guys up. I mean, they're not going to be focusing on you. In fact, they will be pretty much asleep. So take them out, and there's going to be a cutscene. Shepard, you must authorize release. Pod then transfers to loading area. Let's get you out of there. Okay, so now we're going to have to deal with the Atlas, and these guys are pretty easy to deal with. I mean, it's slow, it's lumbering, it's got a really low rate of attack, and it's one attack is like a missile launcher. The only unfortunate thing about this is being a vanguard, you can't exactly biotic charge up to him, it won't exactly work out too well. But luckily there will be a bunch of other Cerberus guys to play around with while your squad mates are the ones doing all the damage to the Atlas. Instead of being the vanguard who's sitting there with a fire ammo attachment to his pistol. Yeah, that's not exactly going to be the most useful against the Atlas. Now, I'm pretty sure that if you were to try and go and go mano y mano with a shotgun against the Atlas, I don't think it would work out too well. Maybe people that are on the easy difficulty could could do that, but I'm not too sure about it on Insanity. I'm pretty sure he'd, like, curb stomp you or something. Yeah, that's a missile. It just takes out your shields. So, when he throws up smoke like this, could be hard to deal with him. I could not look out of cover right there. So, yeah. But, uh, yeah, once he gets his armor down, just keep shooting him. Just keep shooting him. I actually found a really good spot. Either he was glitched out because there was this little side slanted pillar thing. Or maybe not. I don't know. But he pretty much failed to attack me. Yeah, it was the side slanted pillar. And I guess I got him stuck or something. Um, and then he shot me. But yeah. He's at low health. And then he blows up. Mission over. Yay! Another really easy mission commentated by Ares. Yeah. Okay. Alright. See you guys later.